What's going on guys? This is Taylor from the Southwest Wheel Warehouse. Today we're going to be looking at the BK13ELE-TK. This is going to be our 12 inch brake kit for a 5200 pound axle with Timken bearings and a 6 on 5.5 bolt circle. Okay, right here, this box you get it in. It's got a nice logo on it. We got two smaller boxes down in here to hold everything nice and neat while it gets to you. So we'll pull our smaller boxes out. Right here we can see we have our 12 inch true ride hub and drum with our half inch zinc coated studs. And the way we measure our bolt pattern is from stud to stud directly across, center to center. That's going to be five and a half. Our races are already pressed in. We have our vacuum plate, magnets already installed, true ride inspected, good to go. Got our sticker on here that's going to tell us left hand, right hand as well. We have our small parts, pull these out. So with this kit, we're going to get two hub and drums, a left hand and a right hand backing plate. We're going to get an inner and an outer bearing for either side. Our outer is going to be the 15-123. It's just going to pop in right here. And our inner bearing is going to be the 25-580. And that's going to be for right here. Then we're going to get four seals, a two and a quarter seal, two are going to be two and a quarter, two are going to be two and an eighth. The two and a quarter one are for the older axles, the two and an eighth are for our newer axles. If you got an axle from us, it's going to be the two and an eighth. And these seals, you're going to pop your bearing in, and then you're going to put your seal in right behind it, just like that. Then we have our castle nuts. We're going to get two castle nuts and two cotter pins. We like to make sure you guys get everything you need. So we put our castle nut onto our spindle, put our cotter pin through, all like that. Hold it on there nice and neat. We're going to have four grease caps. Two are going to have the hole. Two are going to be solid. These are for your easy loop spindle. These are for your regular spindle. The easy loop. We're going to come with the tang washer that replaces your cotter pin as well as the rubber plug for the end of it. The regular grease caps are going to come with the regular spindle washers. Then we have our mounting hardware. So we're going to get 10 nuts, 10 washers, and 10 studs. These studs will generally come in the back of the axle plate, but they fall out a lot. They just press in. You don't have to hit them in or anything. You just pop them in. So we send you the extra. These are going to pop through the plate on the axle and then through here. You're going to stick your washer on and your nut on behind it. Just like that, mount it up nice and neat. These are pretty simple system guys. You just mount them up on there, plug them in, good to go. Thanks for watching. That was the BK13ELE-TK.